Miley Cyrus says she didn't spend too much time crying over Liam Hemsworth divorce. Miley Cyrus deals with loss by moving forward. The 27-year-old singer opened up on the Scandinavian talk show Skivlin about how she handles grief and loss, directly referencing her divorce from actor Liam Hemsworth. There's kind of a stigma of coldness for a woman who actually really moves on. I've gone through a lot of trauma of loss in the last couple years, Cyrus explained. I had a house fire in Malibu where I lost my house. I went through a divorce. Recently my grandma, who I was super close with, I lost. In a way I didn't spend too much time crying over it. She went on to elaborate on her reasoning behind not crying, saying, It wasn't because I was cold or trying to avoid feeling something but it was just because it wasn't going to change it. I tried to just continue to be active in what I can control, otherwise you kind of just start feeling like you're trapped. Talking about her tools for coping, Cyrus added, Mine isn't crying to shed that. Mine is moving forward and I always say I heal through movement. I heal through traveling and meeting new people. As you lose one person, a new person comes into your life. Following her split from Hemsworth, Cyrus briefly moved on with The Hills, New Beginnings star Caitlin Carter and then on to singer Cody Simpson. She is currently single. As for whether she's more or less emotional these days, Cyrus joked, it depends on if you ask dudes I've broken up with because they'd say less but I'd say more, emotional. She also talked about her decision to abstain from alcohol during quarantine noting that she isn't trying to make a statement about sobriety. I try to take every day by day because I've made a lot of statements, she said. We started talking about the lyrics, forever and ever no more, this idea that we have to commit to something for forever, which I think kind of sets you up for disappointment. Cyrus has opened up about coping with loss a lot recently. In September, she told the Joe Rogan Experience podcast, I feel that I worry sometimes that I can get over things easily. I don't fall to the floor and crawl up in a ball the way I used to, and I think that's a part of me growing up.